Hey, Heather Belmar here, and I am here to chat with you today about what I kind of feel has been the big kind of topic so far this year, at least in my neck of the woods, and that is mortgage interest rates. And should you, should I be concerned about the rising interest rates? And so we're gonna chat about two things today, and one is gonna be just a historical perspective, and then two, just your buying power today, versus a year from now. And so let's start with historical perspective and I'm gonna throw up a chart here and we're gonna look at just a decade by decade view of just the average mortgage rates. So 1970s, 8.86 average mortgage rates. 1980s, 12.7, 1990s, 8.12, and 2000s, 6.29. I personally bought my first home in the 2000s and was pretty thinking I was big stuff with my 6% mortgage interest rate. So there's that. Uh, so, historically, I mean, we're doing great. Uh, interest rates are sitting in the low fours, the mid fours still, so I mean, fantastic, absolutely phenomenal. So don't let anyone else tell you differently. Um, now is still a fantastic, one of the best times ever to buy a home. Uh, and then second is just your buying power today versus a year from now. A lot of people don't really, I didn't put a whole lot of thought into this. Um, there might be some thoughts like, well, I'm gonna wait a year, save up more, or I'm just kinda not ready. I think we're just gonna you know, wait a year, wait it two years. I mean, just whatever the reason is. Um, something to strongly consider as far as buying sooner than later um, is gonna be two things. One, just mortgage interest rates. Freddie Mac is predicting that mortgage rates this time next year will be at 5.1%. And then CoreLogic is predicting that home appreciation is gonna be at 4.3% this year, which by the way is great news as a homeowner because that's just extra money in your pocket um, or your house. And so let's look, I'm gonna throw up another chart here. Uh, let's look at an average kind of purchase price of 250,000. Uh, so we're gonna use 4.3% as the interest rate. That's gonna put you at a payment today at 1237. And then fast forward a year from now, when we're at that predicted 5.1%, um, throw in that appreciation that CoreLogic is predicting, that's gonna put your purchase price for that exact same house that you looked at a year before at 260.750. Putting that uh, mortgage payment now at 1415 instead of that 1237. Guys, that's $178. I don't know about you, yet I'm not wanting, I don't have a desire to throw $200 out the window each month. And so, point is, if you are considering selling, buying, maybe possibly pulling out cash of your current home to do some improvements, now is the time to seriously consider that. Consult your real estate professional, get their advice, um, feel free to reach out to my team. You can go to our website at thebomarteam.com or emails hello at thebomarteam.com. We'd be happy to advise. So. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to share it with your friends and comment below just any questions that you wanna see answered in the future. And then also be sure to subscribe and hit that little bell at the top so that you'll be notified of future videos which are released every Tuesday. And thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.